What's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. This is vlog episode number three. Today what we're going to be doing is actually uh, heading down to a coffee shop down the street. I'm going to get some coffee and apparently they have this rainbow waffle that my girlfriend really wants to try. So we're going to go let her try this waffle. Uh, then we're just going to do some running around. Maybe uh, shoot some footage around town and just kind of hang out. <clears throat> I need to go pick up a vacuum cleaner at some point today because mine took a shit. So uh, I don't know if I'll vlog that or not, but fun fact, I'm getting a new vacuum. And, oh, also, it is beautiful out. The sun is hitting my face. I'm loving it. It's uh, January, what day is it? It's January 5th at 10 a.m. and it is 46 degrees out and we're in Michigan. This is insane for January. Cannot believe it. But, all right, I'll catch up with you guys when we get to the coffee shop. Peace. but we just left that Fido coffee cafe place. It was pretty all right. I mean, my coffee was a little acidic, but uh, her $7, what was it? $7 something was apparently pretty good. But now we're headed into the Devil's Den, AKA Walmart, to get a vacuum cleaner and some oil so I can change my oil to that. So many options. I think I'm gonna go with the $50 option because that's the one I had before that broke, but it did last two years, so let's give that one another try. I absolutely hate Walmart, but I come here for my oil and my filter for my truck because it's usually the cheapest place in town. But today, all they have is two quarts of what I need uh, and my filter is supposed to be right there. They don't have my filter. And the big, I usually buy a five quart jug, which is supposed to be right here. They don't have that. So uh, screw you Walmart, you suck. All right, so we made it back to the house. Gonna change my oil real quick. We ended up going to O'Reilly Auto Parts. Shout out to O'Reilly for actually having oil and a filter for me. You were about $20 more expensive than uh, Walmart would have been, but hey, gotta get the job done. Especially when it's as beautiful out as it is today. So let's get this oil changed. thing about doing an oil change on this truck anybody else that owns a uh, this is a 07 but anybody else that owns an f-150 that's body style knows that the oil filter is in the dumbest place ever and there's no way to get any leverage on it so it literally takes forever to get this thing broken loose and pull your shoulder out of socket and all sorts of fun stuff but we're gonna get this oil filter off we're gonna finish this damn oil change three thousand years later all right finally got this sucker off Here's the old filter. Now, for any of you that have never changed oil before, which I'm assuming most of you probably have, what you do now, after you drain the old oil, you uh, put the drain plug back in, then you get out your new filter, after you take the old filter off, and then you get a little bit of this old oil off here on your finger. 
and you rub it along here. This helps create a seal on the new filter. Alright, now we're gonna put the new filter back on and uh, fill the sucker up with oil and continue on with our day. So now that the oil change is completed, uh, I got a couple hours, I'm gonna hang out, and then it's one of my buddy's birthdays, so we are going to hibachi and sushi. Going to a place called Sakura to get hibachi and sushi. And I'm not drinking for the month of January, so it might be a pretty low key night after that. I might just call it quits and edit this video, I don't know. Cool, look at that hair. All right, we made it to, uh, there's a bat right there, right there. Sakura for Sanjay's birthday. Gonna come in here and eat some uh, sushi and hibachi. And Shayna needs a nap. She's grumpy. Nice. <laughs> Alright, so uh, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here for today. We've made it to dinner, which was mediocre. Kind of want to stop at Taco Bell now. Uh, I also didn't mention that I'm not drinking for the entire month of January, so we did sake bombs, and that really kind of hit me, hit me in the spot there. I didn't uh, didn't expect them to order a round of shots, and I had to turn it down. Didn't get to take the sake bomb. Walked to Target, got a doormat, and. Starbucks energy drink and I think now we're gonna go home and watch how to get away with murder. So I'll see you guys in the next one.